After Kelly Clarkson performed a version of Katy Perry's song Wide Awake on her talk show, it is possible that Katy Perry may remove the song from any future set lists. The Grammy winner opened her concert on March 19 with the classic song, and Perry remarked on a video of Clarkson's performance that was published to Instagram following the performance. All right, dang Perry wrote, I will never be able to sing that again. As of the 22nd of March, the comment has been liked more than 2,000 times, with many people assuring Perry that she is just as extraordinary when she performs the song from 2013, which was included on her album titled Lugna Favoriter. This is my favorite song of yours and I feel every second when I listen to your version, stated a particular commenter. I love Kelly and the cover was amazing, but I could never change your version. It was another person who persuaded the two of them to perform a song together. Clarkson is known for performing cover songs at the beginning of her talk show on a regular basis, and several of her performances have gone viral. During this time period in the year 2023, her performance of You Are a Tourist by Death Cab for QV was acclaimed by her audience. One of the users remarked, Queen Kelly Clarkson is just absolutely incredible in terms of her talent. Almost immediately after that, she captivated her audience with her rendition of the Spanish lyrics in Richie Valens' song, La Bamba. Her song was titled, Para Bailar La Bamba, slash Para Bailar La Bamba, slash Se Necesita Una Pocket of Grace, and she sung it. The lyrics of the song Una Poca de Gracia are as follows, Pa Mai, Pa Tai, Arriba, Arriba, slash I Arriba, I Arriba, slash Por Ti Will Be, Poor tea will be. Poor tea will be. Is there anything that Kelly is unable to sing? One individual remarked, Wow, she sounds incredible even when she is speaking Spanish. Could Clarkson be working on a Kelly Oak album in the near future? Let there be hope. Today.com's West Coast Digital staff is under the supervision of Amy Ely, who serves as the assistant managing editor. She is responsible for covering breaking news, what's happening in pop culture, those viral TikTok videos, and everything else that falls in between. Her current location is in the state of Colorado.